In this video, I'll be helping you with the Alex problem type called finding a polynomial of a given degree with given zeros, real zeros. We're asked to find the polynomial f of x, which is a degree 3, that has the zeros of 9, 3, and negative 8. And we'll start by recalling that zeros occur when our function, here f of x, equals 0. So when the function equals 0, we know that there are three values for x. We have x equals 9, x equals 3, or x equals negative 8. So these are our three zeros, and the zeros occur when the function here f of x equals 0. To find the factors, I would like to rewrite each one of these solutions as being equal to 0. So instead of isolating the x's as they are now, I want to move everything to one side, leaving zero on the other side. So for example, with the first one, if I subtracted that nine from both sides, I would be left with x minus nine equals zero. And this would give me one of my factors here as x minus nine. If I set the second one equal to zero, Moving everything to one side, I will move the 3 over with the x. That leaves me an x minus 3 on the left and a 0 on the right. So here I have another factor as x minus 3. And then for the last one, setting this equal to 0, I would here add 8 to both sides. I get x plus 8 on the left, 0 on the right. So I now have a third factor of x plus 8. So having turned each of these three solutions into factors, I can write the function f of x. Each one of these are factors, meaning that they are multiplied x minus 9 times x minus 3 times x plus 8. And I'm told I can leave my answer in factored form, so I can leave it here. And I can see that in this form, if I were looking for zeros instead of being given them, I could set each one of these factors equal to zero, and that would give me each of these three zeros that we had started out with. So this is our factored polynomial. 